Hey, hey folks, Ben here. Wow, sun's out, so I'm out. Soda pop tasting. It's, uh, I don't know, it's just before noon on a Tuesday. Wow, that's a cool little camper. One of those little fiberglass units. It's only about 10 feet long. Great for a single person, just saying. Anyways, uh, watching the highway. So I figure, since we've got all the sunshine and uh, all the heat, might as well drink all the sugar. And by that, I mean the pop shop cream soda. Now, my fellow Canuckians, if that's a word, uh, that remember the pop shop from back in the day. Wasn't pop shop cream soda clear? And for those who don't know, yes, there's red cream soda and clear cream soda. And I'm sure the only difference is red dye number seven or whatever the hell it is. Does it say on here red dye number seven? No, it doesn't. It's an amaranth for color. All right, well, that sounds like a natural. All right, so any who's and house, I could have swore you know, like cursing, sure, um, that it was clear. And then I saw this at the store and I went, well, that, that, that doesn't seem right, but sure. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. What's, what's that? Is that supposed to be like a dollop of whipped cream or is that someone drop a deuce right on the bottle? I, I don't know. I don't know. Looks like a poo emoji. It says since 1969, but I'm pretty sure they took some time off and went out of business for a while there in the 80s and or 90s before being resurrected. I'll have to look into that. It says sticks and stones will break your bones. Nope, it says sticks and stones will break my bones. Well, that's true. All right. It's a lovely shade of red. Uh, nutritional information per bottle, 190 calories. Sure. 46 grams of sugar. Sure. I don't know. It's kind of a double exposure situation. It looks like it says 46%. They generally match up 20 milligrams of sodium, 10 milligrams of calcium, and 0.1 milligrams of iron. Someone dropped some rust in the pot. Yep. Sure. Ingredients. Carbonated water, cane sugar, citric acid, artificial flavor. Because nobody knows what the fuck cream, cream soda is. I don't know, is it carbonated dairy? No. No. Like, I hear cream soda, it should be cream flavored soda. That's a dump truck. All right, well, let's see what the factor is. Adequate at best. Smell the cap. Oh, yeah, that smells like pure sugar. Yep. Just a hint of vanilla. Just a hint. All right, let's give, I, I can't remember the last time I had a cream soda. Well, there's a possibility there's a tasting video of me doing, I don't remember it, lifestyle choices, but beyond that, I grew out of enjoying these by the time I was a teenager. I was like, ooh, that's too sweet. So let's see what happens. Not too sweet, too sweet. Too sweet means I think like hurry up or something. I don't know in French. That is everybody as sugary as I remember. Wow, that's like drinking an IV. I don't, I don't know. Is it pleasant? I guess if you're into liquid sugar. Kind of reminds me. Let's get that. I don't know why. Reminds me of those. Uh, Spiral sponge cakes, the vanilla ones with the strawberry filling. I can't remember what they're called. Like a Swiss roll, except the Swiss rolls are chocolate cake with vanilla icing in there or something, whipped cream, I don't know. Kind of reminds me of that. Wow, it is hot out here. And I think it's 80 degrees and it's not even noon yet. Perfect. Oh, yeah, cream soda with the you know, it's got a maple leaf on it, so it's got to be good. Pop shop. Sure. Oh, highway's highwaying. So I've been Ben. You've been you. And I'm uh, just borderline getting blinded by angles of glass relative to sunshine and squinting. And yeah. I think I need a new hat. This used to be jet black.
Oh, there we are. Peace, folks. Enjoy your beverages. Comment down below your favorite cream soda. Yep. Or your favorite beverage containing cream. I'm not picky. What's that? A load of scrap metal? Yep. 